not the first, but my older videos where I made this miracle box. Yeah, I know. That video was kind of a little bit bothering me, like, it got views alright, but still, the, I didn't, the video quality was not great, because I was doing my editing and stuff for the first time, so I didn't get the whole thing correctly, but still I uploaded it, I got views, but now I kind of thought of making another video more clear with my voice so um let's just get, let's just get started <laughs> so wait where is it i don't know where did i keep it oh my god did i keep it oh wait i know magic tricks right let me just do some magic okay guys let's just go with the spell abracadabra um that did not work let's try again Abracadabra! Oh, guys, it worked! Yay, I don't need this one anymore because it's not the part of the video now. Okay, um, really? Do you have to come into the frame? Okay. Great. So we have our miraculous box now. Now, this is totally, totally painted with only watercolors. Like, because I didn't have a kill extent, that's why it's a little bit um, powdery and also a little bit dull. I know the colors are dull, but because it's watercolor, duh. And I did it all. Uh, I mean, okay, that, that was bad. That was a bad idea. Sorry. Um, no spoilers today. <laughs> okay. So, yeah. The front part has the design. We tried to do it as easy, I mean, easy and best and beautiful as I could, but it did not turn out well. But it's okay, it kind of looks cool from the further view. And it kind of looks dark in the camera, like a little bit bright and stuff. But for real, the red is not that bright, guys. It's not that bright at all because. Cameras are doing a good job these days. <laughs> That's good, <laughs> but it's not that great in real life, like how I see it right now. So, oh well, just stop that topic. And so we have here on the drawers. If you can see these marks, like what language this is actually? I don't know what language it is. So, oh well. <laughs> I don't know which language it is, but still, I know that they mean the miraculous inside the drawers. Just, just hold this and just open it up. And, voila, and it's also cardboard. I mean, here, you can see I didn't paint it over the edge and stuff, so... Yeah. We have a lot of... Um, I just painted on it with yellow paint. Oh my god, what was that? And I didn't have any orange then. I wanted to protect the sketch and stuff because I wanted to look shiny and like a bead or something. So I didn't have orange. I just used Fevicol. Yeah, Fevicol. Because when it dries up, you get that shiny look. I know that because in my school, um, we just uh, put glue on the books and it became shiny and then like plastic or something so I kind of took that idea from to this idea like it it's kind of clear so I just did this and I'm just gonna show you an overall view like that so yeah where was the front again yeah yeah and I didn't have any clutch thingies on the back so I just used tape on the outside and on the inside i'm just gonna show it to you later so first i'm gonna be showing you guys these drawers first and then we're gonna go into the inside sorry for the spoiler so oops again really great okay great okay first drawer out yes i did make them like this oh my God. look at that flaw oh, flaws at all oh well Let's just 
like that. And so here you see the um, details. I just took two pieces of thinner cardboard and just put them on. So yeah, like that, and just paint it on them like this, like the shading. But it did not look out well because it's watercolor paint, remember? So yeah. And here is the dog miraculous. You can see the dog American. I actually just painted it with, I mean, painted, sketched it out with um, sketches because I didn't have any color paints. I just had watercolors. Yes, and here is the dog miraculous. It's actually a headband, but I just made it into a bracelet because headbands wouldn't fit in this drawer. Really. Look at how small it is. It's smaller than my hand. It's just this much of my hand. So, yeah. So I just painted it on and I just put some very cool on this to make it look shiny as usual. And ta ta ta. I know. I know. Don't curl, but I stitch it on on cardboard. Really? I am just great. I could actually wear this outside, but it's cardboard and look at this. So I just can't. But it looks pretty cool, like shiny and stuff because it was a fabric call, but I could actually use varnish now because I have it now. Because you know what? I if I have that much patience, I could make like redo this whole thing again. What? I really do that. Like make it totally with acrylic and stuff. Hmm, that would be cool, but I don't know. I don't want to waste any stuff on this thing because it kinda looks like a monument is right now, like old and ancient. I like it this way. Let's see if I can or not and stuff. And guys, did you actually see this down thingy like this? Because I actually put it on just for this purpose because it was kind of like an ancient snowy thingy. I don't know. I thought like that. It was looking cool and popped up the box. And now, this is. Yes, the rooster. Just put it in. It's so hard. Yes. This actually took. Three weeks to make, guys. Really? And so here's the ring. And yes, I am a little heart because I'm fond of hearts. And actually, this design was not there. I just put a heart because it was cute. And I put a like, I had fabric paint then, shiny fabric paint. I just used that to make it look like. Um, steel or iron or something. I'm just gonna put that back in. Yes, I have to fold it left like this and put it in because it wouldn't fit. Oh, wait. Heavens. Oh, wait. Heavens. Oh my god. Oh my god. Just put it in there. Put you in there. And voila. So, next up, we're gonna go travel to the left side and then we'll come back to the right. This is gonna be sad, guys. No miraculous in this one because I had to <laughs> tear it out, like cut it out because I needed the beads and I painted in purple, but they were black beads. I needed them to so make the piece and stuff. But sorry, uh, yeah, I should be saying sorry to the pig in here. But this looks so cute, doesn't it, guys? Don't you think it's cute? Okay, that's the pig miraculous, empty pig miraculous. <laughs> and the next, ta 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 da 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 da. Yes, it is the ox. So that's the box. Everything is sketched out inside. And here's the what I did to make these spikes. Is hog glue. Yes, I just put hot glue and just made it be like a tip. And I made this ring with clothing. And I 
it's painted with fabric paint, that's what I had then. Oh, oopsie. Have that one. Okay, let's try this one. Okay, so it looks like that. It's pretty cool. Not really. Not my style, I like cute stuff. So, just put it back in there. That's the ox. Miraculous. Next up is. A grey one, maybe it's a blue, who knows? And I wanted to make it exactly like how it looks normally, like in the miraculous ladybug cartoon. So I did this knot here, that was pretty easy actually. And I put a hook and a hoop on the end of the walls so we can wear them. So this, this is the back side, not really cool, but the front side is kind of cute. So, yes. Okay, now, this is the tiger. Okay, it's kind of hard to wear. So, guys, this is how the, um, the tiger miraculous looks. I try my best on this pendant thingy over here. It did not work out, but still, I tried my best, and it's made of hot glue gun, and I just made a big hole on here, and just put it through. Yeah, so it's like that. It's kind of cool. So, yeah, I feel it's okay, but I need to work on it if I have time, but I don't have time. I don't have time for anything. I need this girl. Okay, next up is close up. Next up is Kagami. Sorry, dragon. Kagami? <laughs> I know. It's Kagami's, but it's dragon. So you can see that in here. I'm just gonna wear it to my neck for now. It's gonna be a bracelet. Actually, you can wear it to your neck. But it's not that cool because it has all these cracky boogies. I actually tried my best with this. I tried like to uh, make it into a circle. How I had this quick set thingy which had the circle and I just put hard glue gun and then voila. But my hard glue gun is not working right now. I have to buy another one. And the next one is Bunny. Bunny Miraculous. I know it has a little bit of this thing here. It got a little bit blended with the black, the white. And it's not that great, but what can do. So this is the Bunny Miraculous. So the next one is... Yes, again, I put some little curls on the end. And here's the detail. It has this snake. And tongue, as usual, that just flows, but I can't do all that stuff. So I put some. Um, yeah, I have a call to make it shiny, as usual. And I did win twice outside because I thought this cool. I love this. I love this color and stuff. I don't know why. This is like miraculous. Everything is made of cardboard. Oh wait, I totally forgot to show you guys the money in that. This is the snake design inside. And this is the dragon. It's not that clear because it kind of got a little bit smudged. This is the bunny. It's a cute, but it still got some much too. Wah. Okay, perfect. Put it in there. Next is a goat. Yes, I just took normal tick tick or 
whatever you call them, we call them tick tick clips and I just taped did I tape that? Yes. I taped um, this go go torn thingy whatever onto the clip. That is a clip actually. So we have two of them. So yes. I always stay in here unused. Oh wait. I always forget to show the design inside. So this was simple actually. I didn't have to do any touching. I just have to draw a black coat inside. That's really cool. Oh wait. This one is uh, this one is horse. It's a design of a horse. It's, I just added blue tones here that I have in home. And then I just made it um, to look shiny by and what we call as you know. But now Next one is this is the last one on the drawers. This is monkey. This is actually a crown. This should be a crown, but I made it into a ring because it's too big, you know me. And there are too many bracelets. That's why I just made it into a ring. Design is this. I did not keep my own designs. They were they're the ones original ones. They are the original ones of the box. And now, on to the paper. So I'm just gonna make my camera stand up a little taller so you guys can see this. Be right back. So here you guys have this look. Inside I just put this other border here again. And he used the turn da, da, the eagles one like I just couldn't keep it empty because I wanted every single one in the collection. Even this one is a little bit not that great. It used to be great, but then it kinda of, oh wait, I'm talking about the hot one one. So I just added this pin on the back. Movable with hot glue. And this is the butterfly. Which is nice. Yes, this side. So I kind of wanted that shimmery look inside, so I just painted purple on it, on the shimmery side, and then I just painted baby purple, I mean baby pink, uh, for the wings, and then just put fifty color on it. It kind of got smudged, but you can't really see it in the camera. Okay, next up, the peacock. I kind of like. Oh, why is it blurry? Excuse me. Focus. Look at that. Oh. Focus, please. Okay. What's wrong with the camera? Ulu. Ulu. Okay. So this is the Peacock Miraculous. And it kind of looks smudged as you see. I would love to make it again. It's kind of looking like it's puffy. And this is the back side. It's also a pin, you can wear it. But it's not really that great. And I think I have to show you the. Oh, wait, I'll show you the blast. Okay. Next up is the turtle, Master Foods. So here we have the turtle. I just painted it with cardboard again, I coated it with acrylic and just painted it red black. It's kind of white over here. Why did you think this on the camera? And I just put some hooks on the end so that we can wear them. And here we have um, here we have a honey miraculous. I mean honey, no, no, no. Bee miraculous. This was actually a comb. I just broke it off. Miraculous is a fox tail and it's 
looks lovely on the other side. And it has golden edges because of coiling. I just put coiling paper on the end. I mean, on the edge. And I even made this hoop with coiling. And now for the main buttons. Okay. Okay, first, Cat Noir's ring. So here you can see that I put some foam and stuff for the edges and the inside neonish colored um, paw, cat paw. And here you can see that same thing. And these are actually earrings, but I can't wear them because, um, because of this hot glue that's popping in there. And you can actually wear them, but not for me, I can't. Here it is. Yes. Beauty food. So, now for the design, it's like this. And the peacock design. And the butterfly design. I'm really happy with these designs. The fox design. Honey design, I mean, bee design, I'm like, I'm missing honey in the guy. The bee design, oopsie, don't want anything to happen to that. And the turtle design. So, yeah, that's it for today's video. Bye!